It's time, guys. It's time. It's time to build my Sandman. Build a figure. Got all the pieces with this wave. The heads came with the Green Goblin figure. The right arm came with Spider-Man 2099. The left arm came with Spider-UK. Torso came with the Ms. Marvel Kamala Khan figure. You got a couple of accessory pieces that came with the Spider-Man and the black suit. The Marvel's Jackal came with the right leg and the Shocker came with the left leg. This figure has the same exact body mold as the Absorbing Man Build-A-Figure from a few waves ago. That fig came with some great accessories, and I'm happy that we get some great accessories with Sandman too. Very nice that we get two battle hands and also two head options as well. Really dig that. All right, guys, start with the torso. I like to put the legs on first. Pops right on there. Should pop right on. leg okay that right leg took some doing there left arm in clicks right in and the right arm pops right in as well and we'll start with the standard head Here we have the Sandman Build-A-Figure, as fully assembled and looking very menacing. I had some trouble getting this guy to stand up based on uh, the weight ratio of his hands and the size of his feet. Uh, but beyond that, I'm really, really happy with this figure. Sandman comes with this uh, hammer fist here, also the mace fist as well, very easily interchanged. And he also comes with this fantastic battle damaged head here. Some really, really, really great details. Sandman's head looks up a fair amount. Down pretty well. Side to side rotation. And a little bit of head pivot. His ab crunch goes forward pretty well back fairly far as well. Arms go on about the A far. Rotate up and around with no interference. Single jointed elbows on the sand arms. The wrist rotation and wrist pivot as well. We get a waist swivel on the Sandman. The ball hip joints upper thigh cut and extreme extension there double joint knees and limited ankle articulation on this guy but he does have a nice pivot to get his feet in a good position here he is with his battle damage face and his hammer fist attachment excited to get this guy into some poses have him battle my web slinging Spider-Man collection. Here we have the entire wave. From left to right we have the Green Goblin, the Shocker, the Jackal, Ms. Marvel, Black Suit Spider-Man, Spider-UK, and Spider-Man 2099. And in the back, the Build-A-Figure of this Sandman. This is one of my favorite Build-A-Figures in a long time. Really like this wave. Very few complaints throughout, and uh, a lot of great new sculpts and new figures to be had here. Adding four new villains and four new heroes to my collection. Really, really nice and even wave as far as affiliations here in these characters. If I had to pick a favorite figure out of the wave, it would definitely be the Green Goblin figure. Uh, really nice head sculpt on that there. Uh, my least favorite figure in the wave would probably be uh, Spider UK because uh, he's just a little plain Jane compared to the rest here. It's kind of hard to say. Uh, Kamala Khan getting her first action figure is pretty cool. Jackal's got a brand new body mold and sick articulation. 
Uh, there's some really good stuff going on in this wave, and I'm very happy that I picked up the whole deal.